Welcome to my channel, Top 10. On October 7, 2023, a significant event unfolded in the Middle East. Hamas launched a large-scale offensive against Israel from the Gaza Strip, breaching the Gaza-Israel barrier and penetrating Gaza border crossings, nearby Israeli cities, military installations, and civilian settlements. What makes this event remarkable is that it marks the first direct conflict within Israel's de jure territory since the 1948 Arab-Israeli War. The day began with the early morning sky filled with rockets launched against Israel, accompanied by vehicle-transported incursions into Israeli territory. These actions resulted in multiple attacks on surrounding Israeli civilian communities and military bases. Some observers have even likened these events to the possible start of a third Palestinian Intifada. In the midst of this intense conflict, it's important to understand the organization behind these actions. Let's see what Hamas is, so today I bring you 10 important facts about Hamas. But before we dive into that, Please subscribe to my channel for more important content like this. Number 1 is Formation. So, Hamas came into being back in 1987 during the first Intifada, which was basically a Palestinian uprising against Israeli occupation. Number 2 is Name Meaning. The name, Hamas, is actually an acronym in Arabic that stands for, Islamic Resistance Movement, and it's all about, well, resistance. Number 3 is political and military wings, Hamas wears two hats. There's the political side, where they get involved in Palestinian politics, and then there's the military side known as the Is Ad Din Al Qassam Brigades that handles more combative activities. Number 4 is ideology, these folks are all about Islamic principles and aim to create an Islamic state covering the historic Palestinian territories. They also don't acknowledge the existence of Israel. Number 5 is Governing Gaza. After the 2006 Palestinian Legislative Council elections, Hamas took control of the Gaza Strip and set up its own government there. This led to a split between Gaza, Hamas, and the West Bank, controlled by Fatah. Number 6 is Charitable Activities. In addition to politics and military stuff, Hamas runs a bunch of social services and charities in Gaza. They offer healthcare, education, and other essential services to Palestinians. Number 7 is Elections and Governance. In the 2006 Palestinian Legislative Council elections, Hamas won a majority of seats, leading to the formation of a Hamas-led government in the Gaza Strip. This political victory created a division between Hamas-controlled Gaza and the West Bank, governed by the Palestinian Authority. Number 8 is Armed Conflicts. Hamas has clashed with Israel in various conflicts, like the Gaza Wars of 2008 to 2009, 2012, and 2014, as well as other periodic clashes. Number 9 is Role in the Israeli-Palestinian Conflict. These folks have played a major role in the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. Their actions and beliefs have made it pretty tough to reach a peaceful resolution. Number 10 is ceasefires and diplomacy. There have been some efforts to make peace and ceasefires involving Hamas. Other countries and organizations have tried to help, but finding a long-lasting solution remains quite challenging. None of us really like war. It's just a tough and unpleasant experience, isn't it? So, let's hope for an end to these conflicts and bring some much-needed peace to the world. Thanks for tuning in to Top 10. We hope you enjoyed this countdown and learned something new. If you did, be sure to give us a like and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to check back next time for another Top 10 list. Until then, see you later.